Many of you probably know what this is. This is a memory module from desktop PC. Content of these memory modules has been same for a long time. Basically a bunch of memory chips with some passive components. Laptop uses similar but physically smaller modules. One thing that these modules has had for a very long time is this chip. It's a I2C EE from chip and as long as its pinout can be solved, adding new I2C devices should be really easy. Pinout of the IC can be confirmed by checking modules pinout and then using multimeter to check which pins of the IC are connected to SDA and SCL pads of the module. After that, one can solder thin wires to legs of the EE prom to access the motherboard's I2C bus. Here is laptop with external temperature sensor soldered to its memory module. There are just simple wires between EE prom and this LM75 sensor. Now I'll use two applications in Ubuntu to demonstrate that the sensor is actually connected to I2C bus of this laptop. First application is I2C get from I2C tools package. I'm reading a one byte from the sensor and according to table on the date sheet, 1C means 28 degrees Celsius. Next I'll use LM sensors to see temperature in nicer format. Temperature reading is about 28 degrees Celsius, so sounds about right. If I touch the sensor, the temperature reading goes up like it should. The hack seems to work perfectly. And buying an USB to I2C adapter would have been easy and low risk way to do the same thing, but where's the fun in that? Uh, thanks for watching and like always any kind of feedback is welcome.